This is breaking news. Kim Kardashian reveals bizarre ritual her assistants perform before she can drink her coffee comfortably. It's like nails on a chalkboard. Kim Kardashian has revealed the bizarre ritual her assistants have to perform with her coffee before she can drink it comfortably. Appearing on Monday's episode of Jimmy Kimmel Live, the reality star, 43, who remained silent on Taylor Swift's recent diss track against her, said she has to have the cardboard sleeve removed from her coffee cup before drinking it. Kimmel said, you have someone take the Starbucks sleeve off your coffee because you hate the sound of cardboard. She responded, yes, it's true, and I hate the feeling, like the sound, adding that whoever is with her will take off the sleeve while she is not looking. I can't see it being done or I can't hear it and I can't feel it. Like the cardboard getting moved off of the cup is like nails on a chalkboard to me. However, the star has been pictured on countless occasions carrying coffee with the sleeve attached. Kim came on to promote season 12 of her FX series American Horror Story, but made no mention of her nemesis, 34. During her segment, the mom of four told Kimmel that life is good, despite the fact that she lost more than 100k followers after Taylor's album, The Tortured Poets Department, reignited their years-long feud. Kimmel, 56, mentioned Swift's new album, and her feud with Kardashian's ex-husband Kanye West, 46, during his opening monologue, but he didn't bring the topic up while chatting with Kim. Instead, Kim discussed nipple bras, her bond with Madonna, and adding a men's shapewear line to her Skims brand. The two songs, Thank You Amy and Cassandra, were part of the surprise double album version of Taylor's new record, The Tortured Poets Department, marking the latest broadside in the pop star's explosive long-running feud with Kim and her ex-husband Kanye. One of the tracks, which is directed at a vicious bully, is called Thank You Amy, with the letters K, I, and M tellingly capitalized. After Kim's Instagram comment section was trolled, her 363 million following took a substantial hit, dropping by 120,000. When I picture my hometown, there's a bronze spray tan statue of you and a plaque underneath it that threatens to push me down the stairs at our school. Taylor sings at the beginning of the Acid Taunt song, with fans convinced that the person she is actually singing about is Kim. All that time you were throwing punches, I was building something slash, and I can't forgive the way you made me feel slash screamed F asterisk asterisk Hugh Amy to the night sky as the blood was gushing slash, but I can't forget the way you made me heal. She goes on to add, and it wasn't a fair fight or a clean kill slash each time that Amy stomped across my grave slash, and then she wrote headlines slash in the local paper, laughing at each baby step I take. Taylor concludes by confirming she's changed the name of the woman she's singing about, further fueling speculation the track is about Kim. She also seems to reference Kim's 10-year-old daughter, Northwest, dancing to her 2014 single Shake It Off on TikTok, finding it ironic as the song is about you. She sings, and so I changed your name and any real defining clues slash, and one day, your kid comes home singing a song that only us two is gonna know is about you. While the references in Cassandra are largely more subtle, that hasn't stopped fans from calling out the way in which Taylor appears to be going after Kim. Many believe that the title character, Cassandra, is Taylor, while references to the call are meant to allude to a phone call between the singer and Kenny, which Kim secretly recorded and posted online. Additionally, the references to snakes in the song are being compared to the use of snake emojis throughout the feud between the trio. Following the release of the album, Swifties flooded onto Kim's Instagram page to fill her comments with the phrase, Thank you, Amy, signaling their loyalty to Taylor. Kim had posted a birthday tribute to her older sister, Kourtney Kardashian, on Thursday, but by Friday morning, its comments were deluged with Thank you, Amy messages from devoted Swift fans. Sharing their thoughts on social media platform X, one fan described Thank you, Amy, as the ultimate asterisk asterisk hue, while another shock listener said, OMFG Thank you, Amy is about Kim Kardashian. This album is so unhinged. Another chimed in, Kim, your day of reckoning is here, while one simply wrote, Welcome to your tape.